Hello, good day. Welcome to our HTML5 classroom lecture series on Web System and Technologies 1. Today we will talk about the topic 1. HTML5 Fundamentals. What is HTML? Hypertext Markup Language, HTML, is a markup language that allows you to create web pages. The World Wide Web's fundamental building block is HTML. HTML5 is the most recent and improved version of the HTML markup language. A. Markup language that specifies a web page's structure and appearance. These tags tell the web browser how to display multimedia content like text, images, audio, and videos. Markup languages employ a collection of markup tags to describe text elements within a document, giving web browsers instructions on how to display the page. Tim Berners-Lee created HTML in 1990. He's also referred to as the father of the web. The World Wide Web Consortium, W3C was established in 1996 as the authority for maintaining HTML specifications. In the year 2000, HTML was also designated as an international standard, ISO. HTML5 is the most recent version of the markup language. HTML5 allows for a more rapid and stable web development process. HTML5 introduces a number of new elements and attributes that can help you in building modern websites. Here's a rundown of some of HTML5's most notable feature. Semantic elements and attributes are now available. These are things like a header, a footer, and a section. Article, footer, header, nav, and section are new content-specific components. Improvements to HTML web forms, including additional properties for input, calendar, date, time, email, URL, and, search are some examples of tags. You can do with HTML. Text, photos, lists, tables, and other elements can be published online. Hyperlinks allow you to access web resources such as images, videos, and other HTML documents. Forms can be used to collect information from users such as their name, email address, and comments. Images, videos, sound clips flash movies, programs, and other HTML documents can all be embedded directly in an HTML document. Create an offline version of your website that can be used without access to the Internet. Data can be saved and accessed later in the user's web browser. Determine the visitor's current location. First HTML document. Hello world. Doctype HTML is the document type declaration. It tells the browser that this is an HTML5 document. It is case insensitive. Head element is a container for tags that offer information about the document, such as the title tag, which defines the document's title. The document's actual content, paragraphs, links, images, tables, and so on, is rendered in the web browser and displayed to the user in the body element. Metadata. Metadata is the information or data about data. It is about the HTML document, which is placed in the head part and will not be displayed on the page. Metadata can be used to indicate page descriptions, keywords, document authors, last change dates, and other relevant information. It can also be utilized by browsers to show content or reload pages, as well as keywords for search engines and other web services. HTML Tags and Elements HTML is composed of HTML elements, which, are markup tags. HTML's markup tags are its most basic feature. Every markup tag, such as HTML, head, body, title, p, and so on, 
consists of a keyword enclosed by angle brackets. HTML tags are typically used in pairs, such as HTML and slash HTML. The opening tag, or star tag, in a pair is typically referred to as such, whereas the closing tag is referred to as such, or end tag. A slash, slash, following, the opening angle bracket of the closing tag tells the browser that the command has been finished. Doc types in older versions of HTML were longer because the HTML language was SGML based and therefore required a reference to a DTD. HTML5 authors would use simple syntax to specify doc type as follows. Doc type HTML the above syntax is case insensitive. Character encoding HTML5 authors can use simple syntax to specify character encoding as follows meta char set utf8 the above syntax is case insensitive it's common practice to add a type attribute with a value of text javascript to script elements as follows script type text javascript src script file dot js slash script html5 removes extra information required and you can use simply following syntax script src script file dot js slash script so Far you were writing link as follows link or style sheet type text, CSS ref style file dot CSS HTML5 removes extra information required and you can simply use the following syntax link or style sheet ref style file dot CSS let us create the HTML5 document. You need to type in the following HTML tag to create the document. Notice the new elements such as header, navigation, article, section aside, and footer. Later we'll be using them in depth in our activities. Save the document as web page. Then open the file in a browse it to get the same results. Evaluation 1. Define the following terms. 1. HTML 2. Markup tags 3. Metadata 4. Doctype 5. W3C. Thank you for watching. Make sure to leave a positive comment, like, share and subscribe.